Update. I got in touch with Premier Logo's office. I spoke with his secretary. She's going to make sure where my emails went. I'm going to forward her emails, but yesterday we had a power outage here in Ville Saint Laurent. <coughs> I couldn't do that. But you know what? It's coming. The right people are being notified. And you know what? Time is running out. The truth is coming. The reckoning is here. See, Quebec is not going to allow what happened to me go unpunished. So, it all depends if you, what side you're on. If you want to make amends, you know where to contact. You know my lawyer's information. One of them. So, you need to understand what you've done. Save your life. Save your family. Save your wife. Save your money. Your house. Because under a criminal act, everybody can come after you in your pocket. So, let me know. If you've done some, some things that are pretty shady and you hurt a lot of families, but remember, your insurance is not going to cover you under a criminal act. And if you think that you're getting away with it, think again. Even if you destroy the files, there's still a trace. Everything can be found out. And then there's more criminal charges. So you know what? I would tell the truth. Tell the truth, shame the double. Because right now you have a lot of things that you have to make up for. So you know what? I would rather get a slap on my hands, a couple of fines, and end it. <coughs> Let the insurance company deal with the downfall and let it be a part of your past or you want to be like that doctor in Mexico that got arrested an IVF doctor got arrested and was brought back to justice you can go on the run you can hide but they will find you so you know what it all depends on what side you're on See, I missed up my last video. It was better than Swanda. But, you know, it is what it is. <coughs> See. You see, you hurt children like this by taking away their siblings. Look at her and tell me. Can you be forgiven for what you've done to her? And what you've done to my son, Zane? So you know what? This is what you hurt. <coughs> you stole her sibling. You stole a lot from me and countless other women. For what? For money? You're willing to hurt families and take away their children? For what? This is what you took away from them. So ask yourself when you look at, into your patient's eyes, do you think that they will have forgiveness for you when this comes out? That you sold something precious like this little girl? Ask yourself, how much forgiveness will they have? I would rather deal with the lawyers and just let the government give you a couple of slap on the hand and a couple of fines and a new law will be put into place where this will never happen again? Or do you want criminal investigations to come out of this? And the rabbit hole is all around you. Like Alice in Wonderland. Which rabbit hole do you want to fall down? Let BJ Take the fall. As you know and I know what she did done to me. She ran out of the room with my embryo and impregnated that other woman. So you know what? Tell the truth. Shame the devil. 
our both of you are gonna go down the rabbit hole where you're gonna be in jail. And then criminal investigations will happen. Families will put a class action lawsuit on you and take everything you have. And the insurance company is not gonna help you. See? See, this is a precious little girl. Don't mess with families and their babies. Now? Because of your greed and the profit that you wanted to make off women. You're in Alice in Wonderland. What character do you want to be? What rabbit hole do you want to fall down? Because the Quebec government is coming for you.